Well, it finally happened. I've had a website, the cryaloud1611.weebly.com website. I've had it up since 2000, probably somewhere around 2011. And finally, they said that I violated something, uh, one of the rules. But they wouldn't tell me which one it was, and, and they wouldn't tell me what I did. But they took it down, and they said it cannot be reversed. Well, boo-hoo-hoo, -hoo. I mean, big deal. I mean, you know what? I put a lot of work and a lot of effort into the thing. I, <clears throat> I didn't keep up with it like I should, should have. And I never made the Cry Loud 1611 my domain name. Maybe, maybe if I paid for a website or something like that, it would be a different story. But, um... The reason why I say that to you guys not because I don't I don't I don't need any sympathy whatsoever at all, believe me. <laughs> Hold on. The reason why I say that is to just let you know and let the world know that I am not quitting. Amen. So we got this, we got literature here. And uh there's really no website or anything like that for anybody to go to, check it out. That was what the big reason why I did that. One of the big reasons why I started the website so they can have more links and more things that I do. But I guess what we plan on doing now, especially with the cards, is using other Bible believing uh, ministries' websites. So instead of just one, we could well have, uh, we'll have several. Uh, different ones and and people will get a little churn. I'll have all kinds of cool websites to go to. Better websites than mine anyway. Amen. And uh, stuff where they can learn about the Bible, listen to preaching, get edified and, and get strong in the Lord. Amen. So needless to say we ain't quitting. Amen. We're going to keep on going. I heard a uh, I've been listening to Dr. Ruckman's uh, church history tapes, probably from the 70s. They're transferred to an MP3 file, and I urge you and anybody that's listening to this that has not listened to that, please get it. It's, I think it's 20-something dollars. I don't know what it was. But it's worth it, worth every penny. But he's talking about... Uh, all the different men that God used in, in history. And uh, one thing they all had in common was the King James Bible, uh, especially after the King James Bible was out. But number two, I was listening to about George Mueller. He put out 111 million gospel tracts. So just imagine that. That's a good goal if, uh, if you don't have one, amen? 111 million. Don't quit, my friends. Amen. Uh, I'm sure there's a Bible verse that says don't quit. Let me know which one it is. I can't think of one right now. Love you guys. I just want to let you know what's going on and, and let you know I'm still on the front lines here no matter what. And, and remember, social media is not your friend.